Uh, hello everyone! I'm home! Uh, honey? Why is our living room so festive? Now, don't be upset, sweetie, but we're having a few people over tonight. What? A party? But I get so nervous at parties! Me too. Why don't you just call everyone back and explain that I knew you wouldn't like the idea, but I also knew that you would have fun once everyone is here. I already invited all the neighbors, so it's too late to back out now. Please try to set a good example for Brady. I don't like parties. I'm shy. All right, all right. I'm sure it'll be fine. Oh, are those cookies? Mm, nope. Not until the guests arrive. I guess that's them now. Chantel, I'm so glad you could make it. Earl, this is our neighbor Chantel. And I assume this is her lovely partner? Oh, him? No, no, he's, uh, yes, I'm her boyfriend. Well, so nice to meet you. Come in. I'm so glad you came. What are you doing? No one knows us here, Chantel. We don't have to pretend that we're not together. Let's just be ourselves for once. Hello, Chantel. Luke? What are you doing here? I came with my, uh, associate at Calaris. I'm not exactly sure why we came here, though. Excuse me, child. I is this the malicious party? What? Th this is a Christmas party. Oh. Oh, dread. I could have sworn the person on the phone said a malicious party. What does malicious mean? Mischievous, cruel, spiteful. Mom? Mom? Yes, sweetie? Oh, Mr. Stein. I'm, I'm so glad you're here. What? I don't know any Stein. I'm Dr. Carlos von Science. But your mail gets delivered to our house by accident sometimes. I walk it over. It's all addressed to a Mr. Stein. Okay, okay, uh, Luke Graves? L Luke Graves, we're leaving. Wait, uh, are those gingerbread people? Oh, yes, delicious, I love gingerbread. Oh, hi, you're wearing bathing suits. Yeah. Wait, you, you do have a hot tub, don't you? I'm afraid we don't. But you told me specifically there was going to be a hot tub at this Christmas party. Wishful thinking, I guess. Hey, this here's me Sammy's first Christmas, it is. Mm-hmm. You see, when you're in the confines of the ship's quarters, there be limited room on the cabin walls for calendars. I can't be sure when Christmas was, to be sure. Fascinating. Oh, God, I don't know why we came here. Are all land lovers like that, Dad? Nay, son, nay. That one there is a rotten egg. I can smell it. But many landlubbers are as good-hearted as many a pirate. Dad, look! A camel! <laughs> Anita, thanks so much for inviting us! I brought you some myrrh. Oh, wow. Thanks. Always with the myrrh. I told him at home, some eggnog would be just fine, but no. Gotta be the myrrh. What? Who doesn't like a bit of myrrh? Uh, Anita, is, is there somewhere I could tie up Ruby here? <laughs>《Science um I understand that you're helping out the Batterton family the who the the, the Batterdens the family who lost their home in an electrical fire after that terrible earthquake oh yes yes the people in the basement they've proved quite useful actually although the babies must improve their fine motor skills if they're to be much help cleaning the laboratory equipment I see and they couldn't make it tonight they're busy busy cleaning the equipment yes you mean you didn't invite them well, to be fair, I thought this was going to be a malicious party, so it didn't seem very appropriate. Mom, does that mean that family is all alone this Christmas season? And without a home? Yes, sweetie. I don't think that's right. I'm gonna walk down the road and ask them to come have Christmas with us. I think that's a lovely idea, Brady. You can take your sister with you. Isn't that kind of him? He really is, Anita. This is what Christmas is all about. Our son is conquering his shyness to go be kind to a family in need. I know you said I need to set a good example for Brady, but I think that Brady is setting a good example for me. Merry Christmas, Earl. <laughs>